Hey Daryl friends, this is Elcha Violet Morgan with a follow up for Aquarius. Aquarius daily advice gave me the following messages. Mixed signals, hot and cold, no forward movement, and too many people involved. And it was just, really it wasn't, there was not much of a message, so it left me confused. I decided to do a Celtic cross, so... Here's the main of the Celtic cross. Um, these are... Okay. This is not right. I don't know how that happened. Celtic cross. Clarifiers for the staff. Additional information. And then advice. So, our bottom of the deck energy, we have nine of fire. Nine of fire, don't give up. Protect that which you've created. Have courage and believe in yourself. And page of wands, which is also page of fire. So, um, whatever happens, I would say at least it's a learning experience. So, hopefully you can learn something from it and don't give up. Courage and believe in yourself. So, I'm going to start off with... Okay, we've got the Seven of Pentacles. So this tells me that you've been putting work into something that is not bearing fruit. Putting too much work in. Um, giving too much and probably not receiving enough. Crossed by the Ace of Wands. So, right away off the bat, <clears throat> we've got this fire, 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 fire energy. <sighs> if this is a romantic reading, which I'm going to say, it's definitely feeling that direction. Uh, I want to say that the, you've been getting mixed messages and hot and cold. No forward movement, too many people. That I would say this is a very... Um, that the other person is mainly interested in a sexual connection and probably with multiple partners. And that would be the reason for the hot and cold and not moving forward. Or perhaps there's not another, but they're, they're not all the way in. So, so this... You know, you're afraid, and rightly so, of being hurt in this situation. And you're not wrong, I don't think. So far, we have indications. You know, I've been thinking lately, mixed messages. <clears throat> we like to think if it's not a yes, or, you know, an I don't know, or a mixed message, or we like to think it's, well, it's not a no, but... I think if it's not a yes, it's not a yes, is, is really where we need to be. <clears throat> and here you are giving, <clears throat> here you are giving your romantic energy, okay? It, what I'm seeing is that you're giving and giving and just not receiving. So in the past, we've got the page of swords. This makes me think that maybe recently some new information has come to light. Um, maybe you kind of already know this. Or maybe you just been kind of thinking over <clears throat> about these mixed messages. The fact that things are not progressing. Um, and you're wondering why. You're wondering what you should do about it, etc. Ugh. So in the future position... <laughs> In the near future, we've got the Ace of Swords in reverse. So again, no movement, no new beginning, um, just staying stuck in that energy. And swords, um, swords are mental. This is like, you're, okay, so you gotten you got information, new information in the past, but you're not getting new information now. There could be a lack of communication. There could be a close-off of um, 
information. Um, not wanting you to find out more than what you already have. Or just simply not, you know, nothing new is coming to light. All right, and this has you up, up at night, confused, trying to figure things out. Okay. The. environment or what's happening around you is kind of like it's just a no win situation no win I think you know that probably and are struggling with that so this three of cups I feel like you're um, hoping is there a third party involved that obviously is not what you're hoping for Somehow, maybe you're hoping that this can work out amicably, or even that you can just kind of keep. I mean, we've got all signs pretty much of kind of a third party thing. Maybe you think that, that you're, there's some way to, to game this or win it. I just don't think that's the case. With the outcome, we have the Page of Pentacles. Yeah, this is not coming into fruition. It's not um, it's not manifesting into the new beginning that you are desiring. And so these are clarifiers for these cards. So Nine of Swords, and I've got the Ten of Earth. Ten of Earth in reverse. So, Ten of Earth is a happy family life, financial security, finding magic in the little things in life. So, I'm getting kind of two stories about this. This is in reverse. So, basically we're saying the family, the happy family, the happy outcome that you're looking for is not happening. Um, it's reversed. Or, it could also be that... You are the third party, and there's already this third, this um, happy family uh, going on in another. You're the one being left out in the cold, is what I'm seeing here. Either way, um, if there's a happy family, it's not going to be involving you. I feel like this hot and cold person, they're either looking away from an existing family or they're looking forward to someone who's not you. You know, when they say, a lot of times, um, you know, they're, they're not ready um, for a commitment or they're not interested or whatever, they don't want that. And then the very next person they get with, they're married in five minutes. That could be the situation here as well. Now to clarify this no-win situation, we've got the dreamer in reverse, so... Yes, you're seeing, you're hoping, you're wishing for, against hope, for something that's just not coming about. Um, yeah. Dreamers in reverse. Dreams are just not coming true. Alright, so. And this is in your environment, so, you know, with the hot and cold, I think you're getting some indications, maybe, that, that there's some way that you can win this. Um. But it's just not coming about. Um, four of air. Time to, to rest or take a vacation. Allow more time before making a decision. Meditation may prove provide answers. Yeah. I do think that you need to take time out for yourself. Personal time. Resting time. Maybe hang out with some friends. Um, get outside perspective on this. And then for the outcome card, we have strength. So things are not manifesting as you want them to. And this is, um, that's the page of earth, that's the ten of earth, okay. Um, so, but you have great inner strength, and you can release harsh judgments, um, have forgiveness and compassion. Just look at it like, you know, this is not working out for your own best interests. 
Uh, I would recommend moving on to something else. This is going to end up probably having to be a two-parter. There's the Celtic cross. I'm just going to end it here, upload this, and then I'll do the extended version with, um, this is additional information and advice. So, thank you for joining me, Tarot Friends. Um, this has been the Celtic Cross, part one reading for Aquarius. Ooh, be well.